In December of 1941, Japan closely monitors the events in Europe. As part of its plans for expansion in Southeast Asia, Tokyo had been prepared in 1941 for a preemptive strike of U.S. forces in the Pacific. On December 7th, Japanese planes attacked the American naval base at Pearl Harbor. Nearly four years later, the U.S., Britain, and Soviet Union would meet at Yalta, where the USSR would agree to attack the Japanese in Northeast Asia. As World War II neared the end in Europe, Japan was suffering significant losses to American forces in the Pacific. In the July of 1945, the Potsdam Proclamation laid out the conditions for the unconditional surrender of Japan. Apparently unable to give up the dream of a great Asian empire, the Japanese refused. Ivanashamanahu. 當時的話呢,蘇日互不解放條約。Japan rejects the Potsdam Proclamation. Soviet leader Joseph Stalin steps up preparations for an invasion, but the many fortresses built by the Japanese may be a formidable obstacle. Red Army headquarters in the Far East receives orders to secretly carry out its largest single redeployment. Потом, значит, как раз при, прибыли мы сюда на, даль, на Дальний Восток. Stalin dispatched nearly all of his senior Soviet generals, a great deal of equipment and provisions to units stationed in the Far East. It was unparalleled, but as the Soviet army was preparing, the Japanese army was downsizing. Taiwan War broke out. Ah, this Guangdong Division's strength, or rather, Guangdong Division's leader, simultaneously was dropped to the Taiwan Battle Field. So, the Southern Guangdong Division, the only remaining unit of three divisions, was. 呃,蘇聯紅軍撐資的稻草人兵團不堪一擊 The redeployment of troops by the Soviets went unnoticed by Japan. On August 8th of 1945, the Japanese Kwantung Army celebrated its last Daishou consecration. But it also received some shocking news. 他的话认为他们两家的话苏联肯定不会出兵的话来打他是吧后来的话这个当听到这个苏联一九四五年的八月八号下午莫鲁托夫外交人民委员交给那个日本驻苏联的大使佐藤的先生书以后他下台了
the Japanese Kwantung army had no hope of defeating the Red Army. The United States had dropped the first atomic bomb on Hiroshima. The tremendous power of this bomb had instantly destroyed an entire city. Then Japan was stunned by a declaration of war from the Soviet Union. On the 9th of August in 1945, along a front stretching several thousand kilometers, the Red Army moved east, west, and north, crossing the rivers that marked the border, and began moving against Japanese forces. Soviet bombers with fighter cover dropped tons of high explosives on Japanese fortifications, cities, and railway hubs. The Kwantung Army headquarters was in a state of increasing panic. Commander Otozo Yamado was attending a kabuki performance in Dalian. A plane was dispatched to bring him back. August 9th, the United States drops its second atomic bomb. The Japanese military is at a loss how to respond. It takes until the early morning of the 10th for the Japanese Supreme Command to issue an order to Kwantung Army units to smash enemy attacks using forces on the frontier. In just a few days, however, the Soviet Army bypasses the Japanese forts and was rapidly closing in. As its troops in Dunning gradually advance, the Soviet army stationed in Baikal crosses the desert and passes over the Great Kingman Mountains, advancing several hundred kilometers towards the northeast. Early on the morning of August 9th, along the Asuri River, the Soviet 35th Army launches a fierce and bloody attack on Huto Fortress. Okazaki Tetsuo survived the battle and wrote in his memoirs that the blasts made the bodies of some of his comrades stick to the ceiling of the underground fort like geckos. The soldiers of the Chinese Communist Party launched a pushback against Japanese forces. Mao Zedong, chairman of the Central Committee, publishes the last round with the Japanese invaders, calling for all anti-Japanese forces in China to fight with allied countries in a final engagement with Japan. Yandong在不光是首先红军在打 
，我阿蛮想，哎，中国革命困难的时候，我们必须坚持，不能动摇。Chinese forces helped the Soviet Red Army smash the elaborate fortifications built by the Japanese. However, the traditional Bushido warrior mindset, together with their loyalty to the emperor, prevented Japanese soldiers from surrendering. Soviets attacked Chengchengshan Fortress at Suifenha. The Japanese repelled several assaults. As the Soviet army prepares for an intense mass bombing and artillery assault, they learn Japanese settlers, elders, women and children are hiding in the forts. They find a girl named Gali Yang and ask her to plead with the Japanese to surrender. My mother is very smart. She can speak English, Chinese, Korean, and Korean. She is very strong and strong in fighting the war. She agrees with her. As we have been trained, this is the Gali Yang's Xun Nan. The Soviet Union has been given to the Soviet Union to allow the Gali Yang to go to the Gali Yang. 于是，嘎利亚走进要塞，劝降。大约三个小时后，要塞内传出野兽般的嚎叫，最后传来一声枪响，周围一片寂静。The beautiful and brave girl died on Mount Chenchengshan that day. The Japanese Kuantung Army continued to fight an impossible battle, but would never recover their position. At 12 o'clock on the 15th of August 1945, Japanese Emperor Hirohito, in a radio broadcast, announces Japan's unconditional surrender. Soviet bombs had damaged some of the Japanese communication equipment, so the soldiers in the Hutou and Dung Ming fortresses refused to believe the news, believing it to be a Soviet trick. Askam našem očin težilo, gdje našem lihko, vizdje nam težilo. Što smo vali, oni že spletali v eto podzimelje, oni streljali v živih ljudi, a šas oni kak bi to celi bogi. Že če ga dendi, mogu sa dendi, fej čan čili. V tem učin vankan de ljudi, ne, že že fa hin dung ho, ho hvan ding ho šu, ne, 然后就用那个，还有些油漆弹也好，完了顺着洞口和毒气口呢，往里头灌，灌好了用那个燃烧弹能投进去，啊，进行引爆，造成有毒烟雾以后，大部分的这个日日日军官兵还有开车团一些妇女儿童呢，都窒息死在这个要塞洞里头。哎，我站的这个位置就是圣虎山阵地啊，向圣虎山这个阵地倾斜了。呃，七千多吨炸药，呃，久攻不下。后来，苏军从日军被俘的第三军参谋高野真夫把他调来。呃呃，经过他的劝降之后呢，到八月二八月二十二十六号下午，九百零一人打到白旗，就是从这个洞口出来出来投降的。The Second World War in the East slowly begins coming to a close. The Kwantung Army, once known as the flower of the Japanese Imperial Army, is gone. And the puppet empire, which had ruled Northeast China for 14 years, finally comes to an end.
the Japanese army expended vast amounts of money and labor over 10 years to build the Oriental Maginot Line. It was destroyed in only 24 days. 17 forts built during a time of expansionist optimism turned from staging grounds for an invasion into undermanned and under-equipped death traps. As was the case in France in 1939, the defensive line of border fortifications in the east was totally ineffective in this new age of mechanized warfare. In the final analysis, the forts fell far short of what was expected of them. <laughs> 所以你这个防线做得再好To honor the 32,000 Red Army soldiers who died during the fighting, monuments and cemeteries were built to honor their role in defeating the Japanese army. China and Iman in Russia, two white towers face one another in memory of those who sacrificed their lives. Мы с вами находимся в зале Советско-Японской войны 1945 года. Одним из шести героев краснознамерной Амурской флотилии был старшина первой статьи Николай Голубков. Для того, чтобы э, спасти товарищей и обеспечить продвижение личного состава, необходимо было ДОТ уничтожить. Николай Голубков, имея стрелковое оружие, автомат и гранаты, и гранаты стал подбираться к этому доту. Будучи раненым, он из последних сил бросил в абразуру дота в противотанковые гранаты. В результате подрыва дота он погиб. After the war, many former Japanese soldiers and peace groups began the task of exposing the dark history of Japanese militarism. They unearthed skeletons of the dead and found bullet casings. Their work left a deep sense of pain. え、あの、Over half a century, this history was shrouded in darkness.
But the nightmare of war can never be truly forgotten. The conflict changed people's lives and threatened to destroy the very fabric of the local culture. The fortresses in these mountains and valleys are a quiet reminder of the violent events that took place here. Для того, чтобы сохранить мир на планете, люди, люди должны действовать сообща. Только когда мы вместе, вот тогда мы не победим. И тогда никакой фашизм победить не может. Неважно, в какой стране он начинает свои действия. Это 